Hi guys, welcome to the video. Please remember that if you enjoyed this video, why not subscribe? And while you're at it, hit that bell icon, and then you'll get updated every single time I upload a video. Today we're back with another coin roll hunt. And as you can see from the title, and from what I've got in front of me, we're looking through 50 pence coins. Now what I've got is sealed bags of 50p coins. And I always mention that when you've got sealed bags, it's always worth before opening them just to have a look to see if you've got any of the same variant, a full bag of the same variant inside. And I did this before I started this video. And what I've got here, which is amazing, I have a full bag of Newton 50 pence coins. Now, it's a full bag bar one coin. I can't see it at the moment, but there's one Beatrix Potter 2016 coin in here. But apart from that, it's a full bag of Newtons, which is amazing. And considering it's a fairly low mintage coin here, like 1.8 million of the Newton coins were minted, I'm not gonna open this bag. I'm gonna put it to one side in my collection and see if they go up over time. And I'm gonna keep it sealed because who knows, if I do go to sell it, somebody might be more interested in it like this, unopened, a full bag. So there we go. I'm only actually gonna be looking through four bags today. So let's get straight into these. So there we go. I'm looking for the usual. So there's a bunch of Beatrix Potter 2017s that I still need. And quite a few of the other 2017 50Ps. And as usual with these ones, I'm looking for 2008 dated ones. So that's the Britannias. That's a low mintage coin. And they're only worth maybe two to three pounds, but still worth more than the 50 pence that it is. And then with the shields, which is this one here, I'm looking for 2009, 2010, 2011, and 2016, the NIFC years. And the only reason that we would find one of those whilst coin roll hunting is if somebody actually took it out from an annual coin set and spent it. So there we go, Britannias. And I always check the Britannias off camera and let you know at the end if I found any 2008. But with the shields, it's quick enough just to check them on screen. As you can see here, I've only got four. So I've got a 2015, 2012, 2015, and 2015. No good. So on to the third bag. But only the second really, because what a find. I am well chuffed with that. When I got them home, I hadn't actually looked at them until I got them home, and then I just thought, oh, there's a Newton in there. And then all of a sudden I noticed that there's a few Newtons in there. And yep, awesome find. So like I said, it's always up to you if you find a full bag like that, whether or not you're actually gonna open it up. It depends really on the mintage really, doesn't it? I mean, if it was a high mintage coin, it's probably just not worth keeping it sealed, but I think it's definitely worth keeping it sealed with regards to them being a low mintage coin, such as the Newton. Here we go, we haven't actually found any other variants, but then again, I found a full bag. So that's pretty cool. So, 2012, 14, 14, 15, and eight. No good there. So yeah, hopefully I will actually find some variants today apart from the 20 that are in there. So I can't actually show them off, but that's still cool. Here we go, first variant. There we have the Dictionary's 50 pence coin. Here we go. Britannia, 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 Britannia. And that is one haggard looking 2015. Doesn't look great. I've already checked that one now, so. There we go, and we have our second variant. There we go, that one there is the Scouts 50 pence coin. Nice, uh, Britannia, and Britannia, another one, and here we go, our third variant. That one there is the Victoria Cross 50 pence coin. Nice, so that's three in the bags. And there we go, all Britannias. So, on to the last bag. 
so yeah, I'm still looking for, like I said, the two of the 2017 Beatrix Potters. And as usual, I think it'll be quite a while until we see the likes of the 2018 coins anywhere near circulation, especially Paddington. It's going to be quite a while, I think. Something quite shiny coming up here. What is this? There we go. We've got a variant. So I'll put that down. So it's a Mrs. Tiggy Winkle. And I remember somebody asking me a while back, why have I got such a problem with finding this coin when I find many other of the same variants quite often? Uh, the honest answer to that is when I thought about it, I was like, yeah, I just don't like the design. I really don't like the design on that coin. It's probably the 50 pence coin that I dislike the most. There we go, Britannia, Britannia. Britannia, Britannia, Britannia. There we are. So taking away one bag has really made a difference in how long this has taken. But 2013, 2013, 2014. So there we go. If you come back in a second, I'll have been through the Britannias and see if I've got a 2008 dated one. And then we'll go through everything else that I've got today. So here's my haul from today. And as you can see, I found a Britannia. 2008 dated Britannia so nice like I said only worth maybe two to three pounds but worth more than 50 pence so I always put them to one side in my private collection I don't sell coins myself so here we go so apart from the amazing find here which is the full sealed bag of Newtons awesome I also got a dictionaries 50 pence coin Scouts Victoria Cross Mrs. Tiggy Winkle, and then the 2008 Britannia, which is an amazing find again. But yeah, let me know in the comments section below, what have you found recently? Either when you've been doing your own coin roll hunt, or maybe something you've got in change. But let me know in the comments section because that always interests me. But please leave a like if you enjoyed this video, and please subscribe for future content on coins. Thanks for watching.